this used to be good law. It's so gentle. Could have washed this quick. See? Just put warm water on that rag and I'm holding it over his eye. But he wants to escape though. I never got him right. I don't want to hurt him. Come on. It's okay. I've got him. I'm not hurting him. I've just got him round the neck. I want him to move a bit anyway. I'm holding that. Just washing it out. It's okay. It's okay. Should we go? I hope I've got this trick. He knows I'm helping him though. I'm rubbing the bottom of his beak while I'm holding the warm cloth on his eye. It's okay, it's okay. Wait, 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 stay. Not done. Put him in there, he's gonna panic. Okay, come on. Just keep him in the arm for a minute. I'll try and pop his head down. I'm going to go straight for the eye drops now. And I've got some wet bread. I've never given him bread, but I'm going to give him bread as a treat. Just for a bit of salt. Nearly done. Nearly done. Nearly done. Oh, it's so painful for him. It's okay. It's okay. It's gonna be a blue stroke. If this kid survives, and I know it's a little girl because she's so timid and soft, I'm gonna treat it like a dog. I'm gonna feed it and get her toys and get a little lead. And I'll take it for walks on a on a That's it. I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. It's okay, it's okay, it's okay. Get some bread. And it's okay, poorly eye. I've done it. We've done it. That's okay. And he just goes back up there. Just because it sits with pigeon. Poor thing, look how bad his eye is. Still got a bit of um, antiseptic cream on his head where I've been putting it on his cut. He's got cuts on his head as well. I tell you now, I'd never ever use death by kindness. Look at him, he's rubbing his beak. Still got a bit of food on his beak, that's what he cares about. And I'm gonna make you better again, mate. He's holding his wing like that, he's holding his sideways. I've got a pigeon down there. Pidgey just chills on his pigger. You on your pigger? Pigeon eagers out. Eagers out all day. In a minute, it's chose to stay in. And all Jackdaw gets. The Jackdaw sits on this bit of wood I've screwed to the door. And he just looks out that window. And I feed the birds out the window and he just watches the birds. So I've got to get him out of the house. So even if I have to just take him to a field. And just let him fly and just follow him all day. Take a pack up with him. I just don't, because at the minute I'm not working. But look how he looks normal, this side. Look how happy he is, really. And it's just normal that side. But he's always struggled to fly since he got run over. That was about 12 weeks ago. He's been out of the garage and he can't fly. I've tried, to, I've released him four times in three months and he just flies into the neighbour's garden and just sits in the corner. And now this bad eye accident happened when he went, he was gone all night. I went shops in the morning, I went driving around the streets looking at all the jackdaws and then there was just one sitting near a tree and I just knew it was her straight away. I'm just praying for this poor little fella. Go. Alright. I'll 
checking again. If I get any views on this, I'll definitely make a blog of it. But all I can do is my best, and I'm sorry if I've made it suffer by picking it up off the road. Did I do the right thing picking it up three months ago off the road?